Who's got the power, the power to read? Who answers the call for friends in need? Super Y! Super Y! He's the guy, he's Super Y! Who's got the power, the power to read? Who looks into books for the answers we need? Super Y! Super Y! And the Super With the Super Readers, adventure waits when you're with Super Y. Super Y and the Super Readers, yeah. Super Y and the Super Readers. Adventure waits when you're with Glad you're here. It's me, Wyatt. Welcome to Storybook Village, where all our fairy tale friends live. Oh, look! Looks like our friend Princess P needs our help. Let's go. Let's go! Hi, little Bo Peep. Have you found your sheep? Aw, that's too bad. Keep looking! Here's Princess Bee's castle. No, Spider, no! Uh-oh! Princess Pea sounds upset. Let's see what's going on. Spider, we really should decide what we're going to play. I really want to spin webs. <sighs> I think we should do that. I don't want to spin webs. I want to do ballet. <laughs> Can we do ballet? <gasps> no, I don't really like ballet. I'd much rather spin webs. And I'd much rather do ballet. What are we gonna do? Oh, my peas, I don't know. <sighs> we just can't decide what to play. This is a super big problem. And a super big problem needs us, the super readers. We need to call the rest of the super readers. Call them with me. Say, Calling all Super Readers! Calling all Super Readers! To the Book Club! To the Book Club! Come on! To the Book Club! Wyatt here! P is for Pig! Red Riding Hood rolling in! Princess P, at your service! And you, say your name. Great, we're all here. And together, we will solve Princess P's problem. Let's go! Okay, Princess P, state your problem. Spider wants to spin webs, and I want to do ballet. We just can't agree. <gasps> oh, dear. How can we play together if we both want to play different games? Good question. When we have a question, we look... In, in a, a book. book. What book should we look in? Peas and carrots, carrots and peas. Book come out, please, please, please! Let's read the title of this book. 
the Frog Prince. We know what to do. We need to jump into this book and find the answer to Princess P's question. First, we look for super letters. And then put them in our super duper computer. Super duper computer, how many super letters do we need? Oh, in this story, we need nine super letters. And then we'll get our super story answer. It's time to transform. Ready? Ready! Ready. Arms in. Put your arm in. Super readers, to, to the, the rescue! rescue. Alphabet power! Wonder Red! With word power! Princess Presto! With spelling power! Super Y! With the power to read! Super U with the power to help. Together we are the Super Readers! Y Flyers! We're ready to fly into this book. Super Readers to the rescue! It's time to fly! With the Super Readers Cause we've got a problem to solve Super Readers To the rescue Super Readers Working together With powers to read In the books we fly On to find the Super Story Answer it super wide Super Readers <laughs> We're in the Frog Prince book. Let's read. Why, writer? Highlight! Read with me. Once upon a time, there was a princess and a frog. Hello! Hi! Ribbit! The frog wanted to play with the princess. Jump! 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 The princess and the frog wanted to play different games. Ribbit! Let's play jumping! One! Jumping! That's just like my problem! You and Spider want to play different games. And that, Super Readers, is why we are in this book. Princess and Frog want to play different games, too. Let's see how Princess and Frog figure out how to play together. To the Princess and Frog! Ribbit! Ribbit! Hi, we're the Super Readers, and we've come to talk to you. Hello, Super Readers. Hiya! Ribbit! Ribbit! We were just going to play wands. Right, Frog? No, I don't want to play wands. Ribbit. But wands are so much fun. Woohoo! <gasps> oh no! My wand! It fell into the pond! How am I going to get my wand out of the pond? Alpha Pig! To the rescue! With my amazing alphabet tools, I can fetch your wands from the pond. I'll just need my fantastic fishing pole. Okay, Super Readers, with your help, we can fish the letters in the word wand out of this pond. Let's throw our fishing lines into the water. One, two, three! 
nice throw. Hmm, let's see. First, we need to find the letter W. Where's the letter W? There! There's the W. Let's see. Now we have to find an A. Which one is the letter A? There! That one! I see the A. Now the N. Which one is the letter N? There! The N. And finally, the D. Which one is the letter D? There! I see the D too. W, A, N, D. Wand! Let's reel in the wand. Make the letters. We fished Princess's wand from the pond. Let's give ourselves a big thumbs up. Thank you ever so much, Alpha Pig. Super job, Super Readers. You see super letters? Which letters did you find? T. K. R. T. K. R. Good work. We need to put them into our super duper computer. Six more super letters, and then we'll get our super story answer. To the princess and frog we go. Princess, ribbit. I have the perfect game for both of us to play. Ribbit. You do? What is it? The frog jumping game. Ribbit. How do you play that? Like this. Jump. <laughs> Ribbit. Jump. Jump. <laughs> Ribbit. Watch how high I can jump. Jump. I'm going to jump really high this time. And jump! Frog. Where did you go? Ribbit. Princess. I'm up here. Ribbit. Where? Up here, Ribbit. Oh, no! Ribbit, I think I jumped too high. Ribbit, I can't get down. See, if we played wands, you wouldn't be stuck. <laughs> I can't reach you. Oh, no, Ribbit. How will I get down? my Wonder Words basket, I can find something that will help Frog get down from the tree. So this word is st ump. Stump. Like a tree stump. Now, let's change this tree stump into something else. Stump is an ump word. I love ump words. Ump, bump, stump. Wonderific, you terrific. Jump, lump, hump. Wonderific, you're terrific. Ump! How about this word? What letter is this? B! B. And what sound does the letter B make? B! B. And this is ump. B. Ump. B. Ump. What word is this? 
Bump, like a little hill. So, what do you think will happen if we turn stump into bump? It turned into a little hill, a bump. And I can skate over this bump and jump high enough to reach Frog. Terrific! You helped change the stump into Bump and save Frog. Ribbit! Ribbit! You see more super letters? What letters did you find? N! T! E! An N and a T and an E? Awesome! We need to put them into our super duper computer. <laughs> Only three more super letters, and then we'll get our super story answer. On with the story. Well, now what, Frog? You don't want to play wands. And you don't want to jump, Ribbit. I guess we can't play together after all. Well, goodbye, Princess, Ribbit. Goodbye, Frog. Maybe you could play both, jumping and wands. We can't. It says so right there in our story. The frog and princess play jumping or wands. See, we can only play one game or the other. But not both games, Ribbit. Isn't there anything we can do? Super Y to the rescue! With the power to read, I can change this story and save the day. Let's change the word or in the sentence. Let's zap it. Ready, set, zap! Ribbit. <gasps> Why, Ryder? Right. Super readers, which word should we use so Frog and Princess can play both of their games? For, on, or and? Let's try and. But which is the word and? Hmm, it starts with an A. That one! Let's zap it into our sentence. Ready, set, zap! Ribbit. Now, let's read again. The frog and princess play jumping and wands. Jumping and wands. That's perfect. Now we can play both games. That's right. We can play wands first. <laughs> and then we can jump, but not too high. Right. <laughs> Super job, Super Readers. We changed the story. I love our new sentence. Come on, Frog. Jump, jump. Ribbit, jump. <laughs> Ribbit. Woohoo! Ribbit, Ribbit, Ribbit. Jump, Ribbit, jump. You see more Super Letters? Which ones did you find? A U S. <gasps> A U and S. 
Okay, let's put them in our super duper computer. We found all of our super letters. Now we can get our super story answer. Thank you all. I love my new story. Hey, look! I'm not a frog anymore. I'm a real prince. You are? But, well, can we still play jumping? And then wands? Don't be silly. A prince doesn't jump. Do you ribbit? Excuse me? Ribbit? Jump? No, I'm a prince now. I want my jumpy friend Frog back. <clears throat> I believe I can fix this. Wands up. Spell with me. F. R. O. G. <gasps> Frog. Presto! <laughs> Hello, Froggy Frog. Hello, Princess Ribbit. Let's play jumping. Jump, Ribbit, jump, Ribbit, jump, Ribbit, jump, jump, Ribbit, jump, jump, Ribbit, jump. Ribbit, jump. Ribbit, jump. <laughs> now we've got to get back to the book club. Bye, Super Readers. Thanks very much. Ribbit. Bye, Bye. Princess. Bye, Frog. Why Flyers? Back to the book club. We found the super story answer with silver wine. Super duper computer, give us our super story answer. Read the letters with me. T A K E T U R N S. Take turns. The super story answer is take turns. <laughs> But why? Oh, I get it. Because Princess and the Frog play jumping and wands by taking turns. So my question is, how can Spider and I play together if we both want to play different games? And the answer is... Take, take turns! turns. <gasps> take turns! So first Spider and I can spin webs and then we can do ballet? I see. I must go back and talk to Spider. Let's go! Spider, I know how we can play both of our games. You do? What if we take turns playing our games? Take turns. I like it. First we play spider webs. How do you spin a web anyway? Oh, I'll show you. <laughs> Oopsie! I may need some tips on ballet. <laughs> okay. <laughs> hip hip hooray! The super readers save the day! Hip hip hooray!
Hi, so glad you're here. It's me, Wyatt. Welcome to Storybook Village, where all our fairy tale friends live. All right, today is Mr. Lizard's very first birthday. Let's go. Hi, Jill. Happy birthday, Mr. Lizard. Mom! Wow! Is this the cake for Mr. Lizard's party? <laughs> yep. A special vegetable birthday cake made just for lizards. Awesome! Mom, can I take Mr. Lizard out of his cage now? Sure, Wyatt. I'll go get the rest of the decorations, okay? Are you excited for your birthday, Mr. Lizard? Oh! I'm gonna get you! <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Lizard! <gasps> oh no! Look what I did! <gasps> what happened? Mr. Lizard's birthday cake is ruined. Wyatt, did you knock over the cake? No. I, I didn't do it! Well, someone knocked it over. Oh, no. I just told my mom I didn't knock over the cake, but I really did. I feel terrible. This is a super big problem. And a super big problem needs us, the Super Readers. We need to call the rest of the Super Readers. Call them with me. Say, calling all Super Readers. Calling all Super Readers. To the book club! To the book club! Come on! To the book club! Wyatt here! P is for pig! Red Riding Hood rolling in! Princess P, at your service. And you, say your name. Great, we're all here. Together, we'll solve my problem. Let's go. Okay, Wyatt, state your problem. I told my mom I didn't knock over Mr. Lizard's birthday cake. But I did. I told a lie. <gasps> oh, no. oh, no! No, that's not good. What should I do about lying to my mom? Good question, Wyatt. And when we have a question, we look... In, in a, a book. book! What book should we look in? Peas and carrots. Carrots and peas. Book come out, please, please, please! Let's read the title of this book. Pinocchio. We know what to do. We need to jump into this book and find the answer to my question. First, we look for super letters. And then, Put them in our super duper computer. Super duper computer, how many super letters do we need? Wow, in this story, we need 12 super letters. And then we'll get our super story answer. It's time to transform. Ready? Ready! Arms in! Put your arm in. 
Super Readers? To, to the, the rescue! rescue! Alpha Pig! With alphabet power! Wonder Red! With word power! Princess Presto! With spelling power! Super Y! With the power to read! And Super U! With the power to help! Together we are... The Super Readers! Y Flyers! We're ready to fly into this book! Super Readers! To the rescue! It's time to fly! With the Super Readers! Cause we've got a problem to solve! Super Readers! To the rescue! Super readers working together with powers to read. In the books we fly to find the super story. Answer it super wide. Super readers to the rescue! Presto! We're in the Pinocchio book. Let's read. Why, writer? Highlight! Read with me. Pinocchio lived in his father Geppetto's toy shop. Welcome to my toy shop. Pinocchio broke Geppetto's new wooden puppet. Whee! 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 <gasps> Uh-oh. Pinocchio said he did not break the puppet. Pinocchio, did you break my wooden puppet? No, I didn't. Pinocchio told Geppetto he didn't break the puppet, but he did. Just like I told my mom that I didn't knock over the cake. But I did. And that, Super Readers, is why we are in this book. Let's go talk to Pinocchio and find out what he did about telling a lie. <gasps> There's Pinocchio! Hi, we're the Super Readers, and we want to talk to you. Hi, Super Readers. Hiya, Super Readers. I'm Cricket. Pinocchio's a little upset ever since, you know, he broke Geppetto's wooden puppet. <laughs> Pinocchio, why didn't you tell Geppetto you broke his puppet? Goodness me, Super Readers. I can't do that. If I tell him, he'll get mad. You could tell him. <gasps> tell him the truth. Uh-oh. Pinocchio, I'm going to ask you again. Did you break my wooden puppet? No, I, I did not. <sighs> Pinocchio. I didn't. I didn't do it. Oh, no. I lied again and my nose got even longer. Oh! <gasps> Whoa! Look at that nose! I have never seen a nose like that. That's huge! Cricket, you're not helping. <laughs> Maybe I can make it shrink. <laughs> oh. <gasps> oh no! I knocked over Papa Geppetto's favorite music box. <gasps> it's broken! What am I gonna do? Alpha Pig to the rescue! With my amazing alphabet tools, I can fix this music box. Okay, Super Readers, I need you to help me sing the alphabet. And I'll build the letters. Ready? A, B, C. Sing with me. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, N, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Sing with me. Amazing alphabet. 
alphabet singing. Now we need to find all the letters in the word box to fix the music box. Which one is the letter B? That one! There's the B. Now we need an O. Where is the O? There! There's the O. Um, okay. And now the letter X. Where's the X? There it is! X, right there. Read the letters with me. B, O, X. Box! Lickety letters! We built the word box and fixed the music box. Let's give ourselves a big thumbs up. Remember to look for super letters. Here you go, Pinocchio. Yay! You see super letters? Which letters did you find? We need to put them in our super duper computer! Eight more super letters, and then we'll get our super story answer. Super duper! Pinocchio? Uh oh. It's Papa Geppetto. He's coming back. Well, my boy, I thought I'd ask you again. Did you break my wooden puppet? All right, Pinocchio, now's your chance. No, Papa Geppetto. Oh, no. I didn't do it. Oh, Pinocchio. I didn't do it. Uh-oh. <gasps> oh, no. I lied again and my nose got even longer. This is terrible. Oh, oh no. My nose knocked over all of these toys. How will I ever clean them all up? Wonder Rat to the rescue! With my Wonder Words basket, I can find some words to help put the toys away. Hey, look at this word. Let's read it and see what it says. What letter is this? C! It's a C. And what sound does C make? K, 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 k. And this says at. K, at. What word is this? Cat. Cat. Cat is an at word. I love at words. It's time to rhyme. Cat, rat, bat, wonder if you're terrific hat, mat, cat, wonder if you're terrific at. Let's see if the word cat helps us clean up all the toy cats. <coughs> Wonderific! The toy cats are all cleaned up. Let's find another at word. What letter is this? B! B, and B makes what sound? B, 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 At. What word is this? Bat. Bat. Let's try the word bat and see if we can clean up all the bats. Wonderific! You are terrific! We cleaned up the whole at 
mess. You see more super letters? Which letters did you find? R T U. R T U. Now we need to put them in our super duper computer. Five more super letters, and then we'll get our super story answer. Right on, readers. Pinocchio? Uh-oh. It's Geppetto again. He's coming back. You should tell him you did it. Oh, Pinocchio. I still don't know what happened to this puppet. So I thought I'd ask you one last time. Did you break my wooden puppet? Well, I, uh, I, uh, uh, no, I didn't do it. Pinocchio. I didn't do it. Whoa, not good, not good at all. You said no, but you did do it. You have to tell Geppetto you did break the toy. But I can't tell him. I have to say no. It says so in my story. Pinocchio says no. See? I keep saying no, I didn't do it, and my nose keeps growing. How can I tell Papa Geppetto I broke the puppet? Super Y to the rescue! With the power to read, I can change this story and save the day. Let's change the word no in this sentence. Zap it with me. Ready, set, Zap! Why writer, write. Super readers, which word will help Pinocchio tell Geppetto he broke the puppet? Yes, maybe, or boo. Let's try boo. Which is the word boo? It has two O's in it. That one! There! Let's zap it into the sentence and see what happens. Ready, set, zap! Now let's read the sentence. Pinocchio says boo. Pinocchio, did you break my wooden puppet? Boo! Ah! Oh! Did saying boo help Pinocchio tell Geppetto he broke the puppet? No. no! No. Let's try different words. Okay, super readers. Which word will help Pinocchio tell Geppetto he broke the puppet? Yes, maybe, or boo? Let's try yes. Where's the word yes? There! There's the word yes. Ready, set, zap! Okay, now let's read and see what happens. Pinocchio says yes. Oh, Pinocchio, did you break my wooden puppet? Well, I... Yes! <gasps> yes, I broke your wooden puppet. I did it. My nose! It's shrinking! <gasps> because I told the truth. Yay! Super job, Super Readers! We changed the story. We helped Pinocchio tell the truth and made his nose shrink. Papa Geppetto, I'm so sorry I broke your wooden puppet. I didn't mean to. It was an accident. Pinocchio, my boy, I am upset about the puppet. But I'm more upset that you lied. You should always tell the truth. We can always work it out. Okay, Papa Geppetto. From now on, I will always tell the truth. And now that I have told the truth, boy, do I feel better. Oh, me too. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 
you see super letters? Which ones? H H E T L. H H E T L? Okay, let's put them in our super duper computer. We found all of our super letters. Now we can get our super story answer. Papa Geppetto, maybe I can help you fix the broken puppet. Oh, wonderful. Yippee! Bye, Bye everyone. everyone. Bye, Bye super, super leaders. leaders. Why flyers? Back to the book club. We found the super story answer with Super Y. Super Duper Computer! Give us our super story answer. Read with me. T E L L space T H E T R U T H. Tell the truth. The super story answer is tell the truth. But why? Because it was wrong for Pinocchio to tell a lie. And when he told the truth to Geppetto about breaking his puppet, they were able to talk about it and work it out. So my question is, what should I do about telling a lie to my mom? And the answer is... Tell, tell the, the truth. truth! Tell the truth. That's it. Thanks, Super Readers. I've got to go talk to my mom. Let's go. Here it goes. Mom, I need to tell you something. Yes, Wyatt? I was the one who knocked over Mr. Lizard's cake. I should have told you the truth. I'm sorry. I'm happy you decided to tell the truth. It's always the best thing to do, you know. I know. How about if I help put the cake back together? <laughs> I think that's a good idea. <laughs> hip hip hooray! The super reader saved the day! Hip hip hooray! Hooray! The super reader saved the day! We changed the story, we solved the problem, we went together so hip hip hooray! Hip hip hooray! So glad you're here. It's me, Wyatt. Welcome to Storybook Village, where all our fairy tale friends live. You know what? I'm going to a sleepover at Pigs. Uh oh. Pig looks upset. Let's go see what's wrong. Hi, Red. Hi, little boy Blue. Cool skating moves. Wyatt, come on in. Pig's in his room. Thanks. Hmm. <sighs> oh, no. Hi, Pig. Ready for our sleepover? No. Why? What's the matter, Pig? I can't find my toy hippo, and I need Henry Hippo so I can sleep. 
That's not good. Where are you, Henry Hibbo? I've looked everywhere, but I just can't find Henry Hippo. What do I do if I can't find Henry Hippo? This is a super big problem. And the super big problem needs us, the super readers. We need to call the rest of the super readers. Call them with me. Say, calling all super readers. Calling all super readers. To the book club. To the book club. To the book club. Come on, to the book club. Wyatt here. P is for pig. Red Riding Hood rolling in. Princess P, at your service. And you, say your name. Great, we're all here. Together, we will solve Pig's problem. Let's go. Okay, Pig, state your problem. Henry Hippo's gone, and I don't know what to do to find him. Oh, no! <gasps> Poor Hippo! What can I do to find Henry Hippo? Good question. When we have a question, we look... In, in a, a book. book! What book should we look in? Peas and carrots, carrots and peas. Book come out, please, please, please! Let's read the title of this book. Thumbelina. We know what to do. We need to jump into this book and find the answer to Pig's question. First, we look for super letters. And then put them in our super duper computer. Super duper computer, how many super letters do we need? Oh, in this story, we need 10 super letters. And then we'll get our super story answer. It's time to transform. Ready? Ready! Ready. Arms in. Put your arm in. Super readers, to, to the rescue. rescue. to read. And Super U, with the power to help. Together we are... The Super Readers! Y Flyers! We're ready to fly into this book. Super Readers, to the rescue! It's time to fly with the Super Readers Cause we've got a problem to solve Super Readers to the rescue Super Readers working together with powers to read In the books we fly to find the Super Story Answer it's Super Wild Just a butterfly. Phew. Let's read. 
Why, Ryder? Highlight! Read with me. There was a tiny girl named Thumbelina. Hello, I'm Thumbelina. Thumbelina wanted to visit her friend Thimble. This is my friend Thimble. Thumbelina did not know where Thimble lived. I don't know what to do to find Thimble. <gasps> Just like I don't know what to do to find Henry Hippo. And that, Super Readers, is why we are in this book. Thumbelina and Pig both want to find someone special, but don't know how. We need to talk to Thumbelina and figure out how she finds Thimble. But where is Thumbelina? Hmm. 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 Hello, up here. There she is, to Thumbelina. <laughs> Hi, Thumbelina. We're the Super Readers, and we want to talk to you. Hello. Will you come with me to look for my friend Thimble? Of course. Yippee! But I don't know which way to go first. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Swallow says to follow the daisies out of the garden, and then we'll come to the river. Thanks, Swallow. But how will we find our way to the river? Alpha Pig to the rescue! With my wonderful watering can, I can help us find our way out of the garden into the river. Say the alphabet with me. A, B, C, D, E, F. Uh-oh. What letter comes after F? G. G. Let's keep jumping. G. H. I. J. <gasps> what letter comes after J? K! K comes after J. Cool, a K. Let's go. K, L, M, N, O, P. Hmm. What letter comes after the letter P? Q! Q! Q comes after P. We're almost there. Let's jump to the end of the alphabet. Q, R, S, T, U, B, W, X, Y, and Z! Lakey letters! We followed the alphabet flowers out of the garden and found the river. Let's give ourselves a big thumbs up. Come on, this way! Oh, this is fun! <laughs> Be sure to look out for super letters. Do you see super letters? What letters did you find? E! S! O! Oh, yeah! E, S, and O. Let's put them in. Our super duper computer! Seven more super letters, and then we'll get our super story answer! Way to go, super readers! I'm 
glad we found the river, but I don't know which way to go next to find Thimble. Thumbelina! <gasps> it's my old friend, Mole. Good to see you, my friend. I want to visit my friend Thimble, but I don't know where he lives. Can you help me? Well, I know where to go. Follow the river to the bottom of the mountain. That's where Thimble lives. I must be off. Goodbye! To the bottom of the mountain. Let's roll! Rats, the waterfall goes to the bottom of the mountain. But how will we get down the waterfall? Cue the sparkle. Cue the music. Princess Presto to the rescue! With my magic spelling wand, I can spell something to take us down the waterfall. I know. A log. A log will take us down the waterfall. Will you help me spell the word log? Splendid! Wands up! Spell with me. What letter makes the sound ooh? Ow! Ow. L! Write an L with me. L. And now, what letter makes the sound ah? Oh, let's write an O. A big circle. O. What letter makes the sound G, G, G? G. G. Write a G with me. L, O, G, Log! Presto! Spectacular spelling! We spelled log and made a log appear. Let's take a bow. <laughs> Onto the log and down the waterfall. Ready? One, two, three! <laughs> that was so fun! We're at the bottom of the mountain. You found super letters? What letters did you find? H, A, and F. Let's put them in our super duper computer. computer! Three more super letters, and then we'll get our super story answer. <gasps> this must be the town where Thimble lives. But I still don't know which house he lives in. Let's find someone who can help. Hmm. Why won't anybody answer? Oh, dear. It's in my story, see? Everyone is asleep. <laughs> Double drats. Thumbelina's right. Oh, my. If everyone's asleep, then no one will be able to tell me where Thimble lives. What will I do? Super Y to the rescue! With the power to read, I can change this story and save the day. Let's change the word asleep in the sentence. Let's zap it. Ready, set, zap! 
Why, writer? Right. Which word should we use so everyone is not asleep? Snoring? Awake? Or napping? Let's try snoring. Which is the word snoring? Hmm. It begins with an S. There! Let's zap the word snoring into the sentence. Ready, set, zap! Let's read. Everyone is snoring. Does snoring help us so everyone is not asleep? No. Nope. We need another word. Which word should we use so everyone is not asleep? Snoring? Awake? Or napping? Let's try awake. Which is the word awake? Hmm, it begins with an A. There! There's the word awake. Let's zap it. Ready, set, zap! Let's read. Everyone is awake. Super job, super readers! We changed the story, and now everyone's awake. Everyone's awake! So now I can ask for help. Hmm, but who should I ask? There's a police person. Perfect! <laughs> Excuse me, uh, Mr. Policeman? I'm trying to find my friend Thimble but I don't know where he lives. Hmm. Can you help me? Absolutely. I'm here to help. He has black hair and brown eyes. I know Thimble. He lives four houses down. Thank you so much, Mr. Policeman. You're welcome. To Thimble's house we go. One, two, three, four. Swallow, and Mole, and finally a policeman. That was so smart. Now we can play! <laughs> Whoa! You found super letters? What letters did you find? L! K! L, K, and R. Okay. Let's zap them in. Our super duper computer! We found all of our super letters. Now we can get our super story answer. Thank you for everything, super readers. You're welcome. Bye, everyone. Goodbye, Super Readers. Goodbye. Why Flyers? Back to the book club. We found the Super Story answer with Super Why. <laughs> Super Computer! Give us our Super Story answer! Read the letters with me. A, S, K, F, O, R, H, E, 
L P. Ask for help. The super story answer is ask for help. <laughs> But why? Because when Thumbelina didn't know where Thimble lived, she asked lots of people for help. So my question is, what can I do to find Henry Hippo? And the answer is... Ask, ask for, for help. help! Oh, if I want to find Henry Hippo, maybe I need to ask for help. Get ready, Henry Hippo. Here I come. Hmm, who should I ask? Papa Pig! What's going on, son? I don't know where Henry Hippo is. Could you help me find him, please? Well, sure. Hmm, let's think. Do you remember when you last played with him? Well, I thought it was in my room. Well, before that, where were you? Hmm, I was in the backyard. <gasps> with you! <laughs> I should look there. <laughs> Good idea. <laughs> Look, I asked for help and found Henry Hippo. Hip hip hooray! The super readers saved the day! Hip hip hooray! Hooray! The super readers saved the day. We changed the story. We solved the problem. We went together, so.